Welcome. Poor posture does affect breathing. It affects the lung capacity. It affects the amount of oxygen that's allowed to come into the lungs to allow the cells of the body to become healthy, to live, to become vibrant. Every part of your body requires oxygen. To give you a better understanding, have you ever tried blowing up a balloon when someone is stepping on it or pushing down on the balloon? It's no different if you have poor posture because if you just sit down as if I am right now and lean to the floor as you just reach, as you're touching the floor, as you're leaning over, you are limiting and narrowing the amount of space inside those balloons, which are called your lungs. As you take a deep breath, leaning over, you'll notice you could barely get a whole lot of oxygen into your lungs because the space is narrowed. As you sit up straight or even stand tall, take a deep breath, and you can feel a tremendous amount of difference of oxygen. This is scientifically proven that poor posture limits the amount of lung capacity. So poor posture brings on shallow breathing. Shallow breathing brings less oxygen. Less oxygen affects less energy. Less energy obviously affects your health in many ways. So as you can continue to achieve better posture by doing the exercises on this channel, and continue to be more aware of being erect, sitting and standing, and doing what's right for the body, you're going to achieve more oxygen, more life, more health, and quicker healing. Many of you with disc herniations, chronic pain, all have to do directly with oxygen. The more oxygen, the more healing, and the quicker recovery. I really hope this gives you a better perspective. I invite you to leave your questions where thousands of people will love to read it and possibly respond to it. I ask you to share this video with others and subscribe if you haven't so you can continue to receive more self-help videos pertaining to your health and your well-being. Make it a great day. I'm Dr. Alan Mandel.